Welcome, gardening comrades. G Mama grows hard in the garden. Plant party! Yeah, you see it. I view your granite. I want some plants on Instagram. Shout out to my favorite internet cousin, Broke Farmer. He was the first person to tag me on Instagram for the IV Organic Fig giveaway that they have every February. Broke Farmer also has a 10% discount code that you can use at the end of your checkout from IV Organics. Thank you, internet cousin Broke Farmer. And this is a plant party for my figs, cuttings that I won. So, see what we got in the box? Well, imagine that. Free product. Woohoo! Okay, Ivy Organics, I'll see y'all. I see y'all, and I can show you this because I got some trees. Yes, I do. Apple, orange, lemon, figs, and now more figs. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Ivy Organic. Oh, wait a minute. There is food in yeah. here. Holy Snanikes. Talk about excited. Yes, I am. Mm-hmm. Yes, we will definitely be using this. Mm-hmm. And going back and getting some more. No that. Okay, pigs. Come on, y'all. I got four of them. Ooh, four pigs, y'all. Okay. Well, I got two in one bag, and yeah, that's what I got. So, let's see what they are. Woo! Yeah, you see it. Cadelia's candy feed. Mm-hmm. Amin's citron feed. Mm-hmm. And these two are Hilda's Honey Green Fig. Alright, y'all. That's what these are. So we must to uh, get these and some soil. They ain't come with no good instructions, but we're going to make it do what it's going to do and hope it do well. That's what we're going to do and hope. So, let me um, put this on hyperlapse and get this plant party started. Yay, fix! Thank you, Ivy Organic. Okay, what had happened was I was so excited to get these that I didn't um, soak them. Yeah, I want to soak them before I put them in the soil so they can get hydrated and they're looking pretty fresh anyway. So, I'm hoping I have success with rooting these. So, I got my bowl of water here. Hit it with the hydrogen peroxide. And let's get these. Oh, how am I gonna know what pig is what if I do that? Oh, we're gonna figure this out. That's what we're gonna do. Yeah, so. And I wish I had a better angle for y'all, but I'm, um, uh, yeah. I'm doing what I can. I'm doing what I can. And as a matter of fact, I'm 
get a thing like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a big one. And I'm hoping this is the bottom and it looks like it because that node is pointing up. Yep, and so is that one. So, what I'm going to do is put the rubber band that came with this and the name back on here so I can identify who is who. While they're soaking, I'll make some labels for the cups. So, they're gonna be soaking in this bowl right here. I hope. Yeah, that's gonna work for me. Wait a minute, I got, I, okay. <laughs> I'm so excited I can't even talk y'all. But, since I, uh, yeah, I got five of them. Wow. Five cuttings. This is what I got. One, two, three, four, five. Let's grow, figs. Let's grow. I'm gonna let y'all soak for a minute. Yep, that's what I'm gonna do. Let them soak in this good bowl, and I'll be back in a few. Y'all, after I did my research on uh, Ivy Organics. I went to their YouTube channel and discovered they have a whole video explaining how to propagate these cuttings. And what I learned is they score the bottom. Yes, they do. So you can tell where the bottom is. Isn't that just a special thing? So let me... Um, Get my good fig plant party together and rolling. Let's grow.
You was acting up. You was acting up. You was acting up, bro. You really upset about that flow. You'll get used to it. You will. I got Oreo some new carpet. Or should I say I got me some new carpet for Oreo so it can make it easier for me to clean. He's been throwing stuff around ever since I put this carpet down here. I'm a renter so to keep him from messing up other people's stuff, this is what has to be done. Oh, that's how you gonna do? That's how you gonna do? Now that I've got my figs potted up, I'm going to put them in here and water them in. So yeah, the reason that I put these two in one is because I'm short on space. So yeah, this is what I gotta do. And I'm gonna water them in until it soaks through the bottom. And this is where they'll be until they start to grow. And yeah, I'm using the water that I soaked them with. So if I have anything left over, then I will, or should I say, if I need to soak them again, then I have some tea. Oh, and it looks like I need to put some more salt in there because that just went straight to the bottom. I just knew this soil was damp, but I guess it ain't damp enough. But no worries, because I still got some soil I can put in there to fill those holes and continue on. I guess I don't have to because yeah you see it dripping I don't need to add no more but I will put some more soil on the top though that's what I will do check them all make sure all the soil is wet because I will not be watering these again for a while. And wow, that worked all the way through. Yes, it did. So, let me put a little more soil on the top of here.
what I keep my mulch in. And you know me, heavy mulching. Yep, that's what I do. Because these are going to be water from the bottom. Anywho, and yeah, this is just uh, shredded paper and wood chips that I'm using. Oh, that's the shortcut. Anyway. I appreciate you taking your time to watch me vlog about my garden. Peace and love, my gardening comrades. 